kerajaan memutuskan untuk melaksanakan perintah kawalan pergerakan. Malaysia is reimposing a full lockdown. Traditionally a symbol of surrender, but in Malaysia, a white flag has come to signify a cry for help. But is this just a drop in the ocean? Each day, 16 million plastic bottles are thrown away in the Environmental pollution contributed to the deaths of about 9 million people. In Hello everyone. Welcome to the Kuala Lumpur Engineering Science Fair International Challenge 2021. My name is Jaden Tan. I am from SJKC Senior Penang, Malaysia. Today, I'm going to share with you about my innovation project called Recycle for Food. Recycle for Food is a hybrid kiosk consists of recycling vending machine and food bank. This project is aligned to SDG 11, Sustainable Cities and Communities. After 18 months under some form of COVID-19 lockdown, the average Malaysian is struggling to make ends meet. A system was limited and difficult for the B40 community to access. Malaysians have come out with a self-initiative campaign, the White Flag Movement, to help the needy. Food banks appear across the country for anyone who needed them. While providing help to those who are suffering, it is important to maintain their dignity and make them believe that they could still contribute to the communities. Hence, I come up with the idea of recycling for food kiosks, where one need to recycle items through the machine to get food pack from the food bank. This is the block diagram of the kiosk. Here are the hardware used in the project. Adobe is the backbone system which hosts microbit and connect peripherals. Microbit process input signals and perform operation as per code program. IR sensor to sense the input of recycled item and send signal to microbit. Servo motor will open the food bank storage once condition met. Micode is the software used to run simulation and program the microbit. The Recycle for Food kiosk will be installed at easily accessed public places such as supermarket, petrol station or neighborhood community centers such as this. This is how the kiosk operates. First, drop recycle items such as drinking can into the recycle slot. After three cans have been collected, the food bank storage door will be opened. Take one food pack from the food bank. For future development of this kiosk, there are a few improvements that can be made, such as to have a built-in food bank storage in the kiosk. Secondly, to have camera to monitor the kiosk usage and for security purposes. Last but not least, to develop and integrate mobile apps with the kiosk so that we could track the food bank inventory and restock it on time. The apps can also trigger the recycling company to collect the recycled item once the bin is almost full. I hope you all enjoy my sharing today. Stay safe and stay healthy. Thank you. We make a living by what we get, but we make a life by what we give.